Okay. So as you can see, the bag. Uh, I've tried it for a while, and apart from hitting it forwards like this, I find the bags very difficult to use at this particular position. Now, um, what I'm going to try and do is to, first of all, I'm going to try and, uh, I've tried to unbolt these, but I did such a good job uh, putting it up, it's freaking stuck like a rock. I've all done myself for myself for actually doing so well. But now it's caused me problems by taking it down, so I have to uh, buy some wrenches and stuff to get it down some proper stuff. Now what I'm going to try and do is to attach it here, yeah, if I can. But I've got to do it so it doesn't interfere with the light, because I need this light. Well, we need this light, because it lights up the garden. So if I can do it low enough, then the bag doesn't hit it, then it might actually work. Um, now, if that doesn't work, because I'm going to try it, then I might just move that to there and then and lower. Yeah. Uh, lower, but all the way to the edge, and it's kind of like on the side. That way I can move around it more, but I prefer it here uh, without it interfering with the bag, hopefully. Okay, let's see if I can do that. Right, yeah, as you can see, the reason being is because I had to put this bloody thing around it and you know there's not enough space here uh, and the way it moves it's you know another thing is psychologically this is very problematic like when you're hitting it especially with your with my left because obviously I'm going to try and improve my left I feel like I'm going to hit the wall and so it kind of like psychologically you keep on looking at it and uh, that kind of uh, makes you weary about hitting it uh, I know it's just psychological. I've already brought uh, this to the go shop so quickly by this. Uh, uh, took a bit of time for me to loosen uh, these bolts because uh, the Raj had actually done them so well that you know this one's uh, coming off pretty easily now. But it took me freaking ages to get to this. Right okay, there, man. Uh, the Raj did it too well. Yeah. This one's alright, the two top ones are a bit harder. Uh, hopefully, I can still use it. That's it. That's it. I hope the plug comes out as well, man. I hope it comes out. This particular thing, because I can use it. Ah, I think I might be to use it. Yeah, looks like I can use it. So, as you can see, things are still good. And, uh, Actually, I'm not going to have to record at the same time, dude, just because these top ones are very tight. Especially that one there. Yeah, so getting there. Taking a lot longer than last time. Uh, the wall was a lot tougher. I had to get the big, big old drill bit out. Yeah. You have to use that small one as well to get to the thing. But yeah, it took this one here. Took ages. This one here took ages. It's pretty secure. I could put no more nails in there as well. So as you can see the white, people are wondering what the white is. This one freaking is the headache as well. So let's have a look. So now I'm gonna kind of hit it on. And this is the moment of truth. Moment of truth. Whether it will align. Yeah. Whether it will align. Let's have a look. Let's see if this goes in. Come on, dude. Come on. Under the jaw. Come on. Come ah, on, don't be. Yeah, that's alright, it's turning. So I'm gonna just tighten it up. Uh, hopefully, this will. Yeah, I've kind of tested it out just quickly. Uh, it seems to be a good position, to be honest with you. It does seem to be a good position. Uh, I can't tell until I've got it fully um, in. Uh, I couldn't punch it just because of the fact that, you know, it was. I hadn't secured it. Uh, what did happen is this started popping out and that was a good test so i had to uh, take it out and uh, then i put i put took both of them out and i put no more nails in the resort well, it seems a lot more uh, secure now so i'm glad i tested it quickly because when i test it properly it'll be tomorrow um, rather than today like i said I've got no more nails on there and i don't want yeah, that seems secure. That seems pretty secure. Pretty secure. Yeah, 
cure. Maybe one more. Yeah, uh, that's a little bit loose, but that's why I've got no more nails on there. Now these one, this one here, is pretty tight. As you can see. Okay, uh, got it up. Yeah, it seems pretty secure. Yeah, I'm not going to really hit it too hard, as you can see. Uh, the original was actually there. Uh, yep, too high up, man. Uh, one of the things is I lowered it. Um, because the thing is, if I really want to hire it up, I can do that, can't I? You know, this, these, these are, uh, you can take them off. So, I'm leaving it this high at the moment, which is kind of um, my particular height. 9, 5, 9, 5, 10. So then I can, and what I've realised as well, when it's not too, when it's too high, it swings everywhere. Because obviously, I mean, it's the, the lower the hit, the more it's going to move. The higher the hit, the less it's going to move. So, um, yeah, I'll see what I'll do. I'm going to have to leave it for the night because I've put no more nails in there. Just want it to kind of like, you know, really, really get secure. Uh, now, you know, I've got an extra, this whole room here now. I can move, yeah. Move. Now I can move all the way around here as well, side. And I don't have to worry about you know hitting the wall or the thing moving. And also because there's a wall there already, if I hit too hard. And what's great, I thought it would hit the thingy, but it's actually nowhere near it. Nowhere near it. In fact, I could have even pulled it in even more if I wanted to. I could have, could have went right up to it. So. Uh, but I think it's I think it's good on the side. Takes up too much space. But yeah, hopefully it doesn't. I'll test it tomorrow. We'll see if it hits. I don't. Th I don't think there's any way it could hit it, even if I was to. If you look here, there's no way. Because the wall's there, so I think it's turned out pretty perfect to be honest with you. Yeah, should have had it on that position in the first place. Fucking nightmare putting it on today though. I can tell you that now. It took at least. Two and a half hours, whereas the other one took an hour. Uh, just be okay. So, as you can see behind me here, but it's the next day now. Yeah, I think it's a good position. I might hire it at some point and just take these out of the But I think it's okay at the minute. It's a little bit soft at the top. That's the problem. But yeah, I think it's come out pretty good. Yeah, I'm happy with the thingy. So I've got a nice little, uh, little thingy now. So. I can do the front here, and I've got obviously uh, the ball here in order to hit it. Yeah. So I've got a nice little kind of exercise regime. Obviously, people are going to go, Raj, you're doing it wrong. Dude, I'm having fun, man. A nice little exercise, a good cardio, good uh, exercise. Obviously, you know, if I need to kind of like use my, you know, fist for other reasons, then fair enough, man. But yeah, I'll go, um, I'll try and do some little techniques and stuff because it's the first time I'm actually going to use it actually. I uh, don't know how well it's going to work. I used it a little bit last night, but nothing too severe. Now, I've had to put that string on there again until I can figure out how to, um, how to actually, you know, it's attached to that pipe because it keeps moving. I don't want it to move too much, uh, especially this way and hit the, the light or anything. I don't think it will anyway. Don't want it to go too much that way, so okay. So, yeah, like I said, yeah, this is like exercise and stuff, yeah, uh, to get myself in shape and stuff and keep the weight off. Um, but also, yeah, there's people I would definitely, definitely box a charity, man, no doubt about it, yeah. Uh, football fans, 100%. Love to fight football fans in a boxing match for charity, make money for a good cause, and bust these. Let's just say, uh, let's just say you might need some medication, Coca Cola, yeah, um kind of you know stop the stop the you know let's just say uh the misery uh other one goes hoodie that corner still up for that i will say this he's been in hiding for pakistan for what was it three months since i called him out yeah now you know even imran khan was saying put dida put dida dar -da -kyo! Dar -da -kyo! and he chucked him out of his jaddi he was in uh imran khan's jaddi seeking asylum from the raj in his non-pubic head, Chaddi, yeah? And uh, obviously, the main one for me is gonna be Asif, yeah? Not only will I fight you in a boxing match for charity, if I ever see you, 
um, because one day we'll probably meet because you said you was going to start putting leaflets on my mother around Speaker's Corner. There's only, yeah, let's just say all this kind of, oh, no vibe. Let me just say we'll talk when we see you. Uh, with you, I'll go both ways because uh, don't you ever think you can be talking like that and going to plot to put leaflets on my mother and nothing's going to happen. Yeah. Uh, obviously, you know, um, I'm going to first use the, the these for a little bit. So obviously, now I don't want to use them too much uh, just because it will hurt the hands. Uh, I'm going to put the gloves on, uh, obviously these ones. But I do prefer um, these because the bag doesn't move as much. Yeah. Because I think the bag, um, it's pretty small. I should have actually got a bigger bag to be honest with you. And I might even do that. I will in the future. Uh, because, you know, obviously, when I'm punching it, it moves so much. Obviously, the bit at the bottom got the strings in and stuff like to hold it. But, you know, for me, it's mainly about you know, moving, a, moving about. Swinging a bit more with the foot. Rather than power, um, you know, I want to be able to move. Now with the other bag, I can hit hard. This one, I'm gonna have to get used to just kind of gabbing rather than power. Okay. The more I'm hitting it, the more strength the more it swings, and the less I can get on the technique. So for me, mainly, it's gonna be um, when it comes to this side, it's gonna be strengthening my left because it is very weak. No doubt about it. The jab. Yeah. And obviously the hook and but also when I'm doing this side it's getting the swing into it yeah. um, so one of the good things is now I can move all the way around now whereas before I couldn't so you can see I can go from here all the way to here I can also go here. So as you can see, I've got full radius now. I should actually move this as well. Move it out of the way. So you can see already, I can see that, you know, um, the problem was when I was doing it before, I could only do, literally I could only do front. I could only do front, yeah. Because the bag, I just don't have enough room. Now I can have a full on workout. Because obviously for me, this is about keeping fit, yeah. And, um, you know, if I can't move, then I can't keep fit. So now I can actually get to really move. I need to go. See this stuff? The strings are on there. You see how they're swinging. And that's a problem. Yeah. Uh, without the string, you probably won't even worry about the string on there. So uh, let me reattach it. If I do it this way. And I shouldn't really use these gloves because um, it'll start hurting the hand. Um, things will go through. Now what I'm going to do now is to go, just basically hit the bag and then uh, hopefully I can move around this as well now. So obviously I need to keep my arms up. Um, strings attached so it doesn't move too much. I don't want to hit the, the thingy. So hopefully what I can do is uh, definitely try now to go for my left. My left are very weak here. As you can see, I want to practice the left now. It's alright, you know. And obviously not, not overly powerful, but it's better than my left. So what I also like is that as it's forwards. needs to be a little bit higher now that I'm hitting it because this part's pretty soft so obviously uh, I'm around 5'10 or 5'9 so this bit's soft I need to get it so I've got to start getting used to hitting here Yeah, so one of the things I've realized with the, um, the boxing bag is that um, 
I think I could have got a bigger boxing bag from the So maybe in the future I will and I'll hang it up. Um, I think it's quite light, it keeps it moving. Um, sorry, let me just adjust this. Now one of the things is I've decided to do it with, I don't know why, it just feels better yeah, when I'm doing it with that. this. Uh, without the boxing gloves on these ones yeah now one of the one of the main reasons is that when i hit it with this it moves so much because of the obviously there's no now i am a bit worried about my hands i don't want to hurt my wrists or my um uh, you know i think obviously my drawing hand i know people can say that's your not marine hand yeah how do you know for those so uh, i'm going to try it uh, hopefully i don't hurt my wrist or my thingy and this will work out better for me um i think i'll put in a little bit of one or two pounds, yeah. I do prefer it mainly because the, the bag doesn't move as much, yeah. It doesn't move as much, it doesn't move as much normally. Be careful though, uh, that I don't damage my wrist. Um, Obviously it's got support on there anyway. I'll keep worrying that it's breaking. I think it's the wind that's doing it. Now, I really need to swing the body though. That's the thing. soft so it's actually toughen them up as well do the same kind of move as well when you're ducking and diving uh, which is kind of like what I need to do so almost like if someone's gonna punch you, you know, move out the way Very different when you're moving though. Uh, much better for exercise. You know. Uh, I'm pretty happy with it. 
uh, test it out a little bit. Obviously, you know, people have been gone for hours. And like I said, it's a good exercise. Moving about. Prefer it. Because now I can kind of, you know, really. So I'm getting used to kind of like moving. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> I'm just getting told off. I'm supposed to be going to shops. Um, I'm supposed to have left like so time now, about 10 minutes to just really do the shopping. Um, so, like I said, um, my thing is going to be going on in and kind of like really you know, moving about. Um, trying to figure out what's the best way to do it. And, um, you know, obviously I do my shit talking at the end. If you don't like it, get lost. You know, people are like, I don't like you when you talk. That's not my problem. You know, I'm gonna have to talk a bit as well. Um, I will say uh, to the true Muslims out there, you know, you were talking about, uh, you know, happy uh, Ramadan. Hope you have a nice time, you know. And, uh, you know, hopefully you contemplate on what's you know, uh, true and what's actually most important to you. Unlike for Dufas, who, you know, for the last seven weeks has done <laughs> 60 seat shots, yeah. He's got, now I know, uh, the top of his channel has got the Shahada. And the Shahada is very important to Muslims, but he's mocked it because all the videos have nothing to do with Islam, yeah, all piss takes. So I'll tell him to take it down. And that's not even me joking. Um, if I saw a Sikh channel, and it had like why a good one there or something like that and they're doing shit like I was doing I told people I, I'd hope some Sikh would say to me Raj take it down you're disrespecting you know Sikhi um, also you know you got two, door, two more days left and uh, you know the guy's been attacking my mother now so it just shows you is this what his version of Islam teaches them you know my last two shows has got you know my mum's name in there and it just shows you up to Ramadan the guy's evil yeah a demonic little prick, a coke-infested little cunt, who, you know, obviously, you know, you know, what they say, what goes around comes around, it's going to happen one day too, no doubt about it, yeah? Um, obviously, all legal and above means. Maybe. 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 Um, the other thing is, uh, uh, whether I do the seek, uh, kind of like, uh, response like a Ramadan month uh, of just non-stop uh, Islamic topics for a month on my channel I'll decide on um, on the day on the 12th um, obviously you know I've got the Muslims that I respect people that you know I don't want to upset and then I got certain people I do want to upset so I have to weigh up which one's more important to me and I'll decide on the day yeah. And uh, the other thing is that, you know, there's so many things I didn't know. You know, the pubic hair situation. Grown ass men with no pubes. How can I respect the man if I'm, if I'm fighting someone with no pubes? You don't know what underarm here. They pluck it. Yeah? Now, that was bad enough. I was like, oh, that's bad. How can I respect a man? Yeah? Are you really a man? But then I'll find out, you know, they sit peeing down as well. They can't even pee standing up. Because their todger is so small, they can't hold it. Because it's been snipped. So they have to sit down like a woman. Oh, the disgrace. Can you really be classified as a man if you can't pee standing up and you've got no pubes? You look like a pre pubescent boy. Why do you like the look of a shaven boy? Because that's what you look like. Is there something underlying to this? You know, forget about the women part, but the, the, the men. Do they enjoy the look of a, you know, prepubescent boy that pees on the toilet while sitting down? Now, I'm gonna do that show for definitely because that show is too much here for me not to do. The rest of them I'll decide. Now, like I said, man, if you've got a pee sitting down, there's something wrong, yeah? There's something wrong. Your tod has been mutilated and it's not big enough to pee properly, yeah? Because we know that the foreskin, you know, has its purpose. One of these is to funnel the urine. Yeah, I need to do a show on this, but it's too controversial. 
to funnel the urine so it's like a hose you can target now if you don't have that you're gonna have to sit down because it's gonna spray you like a freaking water fountain yeah i'm learning a lot you know you know what i said about when they snip it to make it look bigger now this what can i say man uh, that show i definitely do the rest of them let's see now like i said man uh, this is a bit more about me kind of moving about now exercising you know very good exercise um, i can already feel not only you know upper body getting exercise but also my cardio which wasn't happening before which is not moving now if i'm moving it's a lot better uh like i said to the haters out there keep hating man the more you hate the more raj grows yeah and uh the more the raj and eater will deal with his enemies in more ways than one yeah more ways than one obviously we'll see we'll see but anyway keep crying keep crying keep crying <laughs>